Hi, welcome to Palette Spells Perfumes and Panning. We're here with Phoebe and with a Revolution haul and some lime crime as well. So if you'd like to see what Phoebe hauled, stay tuned. And before we get into the video, if you like our videos, please go ahead and give us a thumbs up. It doesn't cost anything. If you would like to leave a comment, I'm more than happy to reply. And if you would like to subscribe, I would truly appreciate that. And if you do subscribe, please ring the bell and you will be notified of future uploads. That all being said, let's get into the good stuff. Let's. So the first item we're going to be talking about today is actually a new beauty hero find. My new beauty hero that I found. I actually found it, I've never heard of this brand before, but I know you had advised mm -hmm. me about getting this product. Um, it's actually the Lime Crime Bushy Brow Stronghold Gel. And it comes like so, in really cute pink packaging. And I got it in the shade Dirty Blonde, which I was until yesterday. <laughs> we get into that later. Yeah. Bushy brow, and it's absolutely fabulous for giving you that bushy brow look that is trendy at the moment. Mm -hmm. So the wand is like so. Tiny, it's a really good wand, isn't so it? You just brush your brows upwards, and it's just fabulous, actually. Fabulous product, and I'm wearing it tonight. And I used to swear by Inglot's. Um, it is the their brow gel or pomade, pomade in yeah. blonde, but this is really good as well if you want that bushy brow trend. And so, you don't have to have a second brush for that. It's more convenient, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I brush my brows upwards and then I use it. It gives you that more in vogue look yeah look trendy the fluffy eyebrows yeah. trendy very trendy and as you might have, if you've seen our previous videos i stopped looking at my brows recently because they're very sparse and i want to achieve that bushy brow look yeah. <laughs> so that's that get into the next item that i've hauled this is from revolution makeup revolution and it's their friends x revolution brush set well, actually, it's one of their many friends. X well, one of their many brush sets. I don't know if it's friends, but uh, it's the lobster design and the pink packaging. It's beautiful. WB Warner Brothers on the back, and we have I haven't used them yet, but three beautiful eyeshadow brushes. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Beautiful lobster design. They're fabulous, really, aren't they? And they're so soft. I love that and I got it in the sale at Revolution so if you're looking for some cheap eyeshadow brushes that are also on the little lobster claw yeah they have that on their makeup bag too the lobster um so if you're looking for some eyeshadow brushes that are good quality friends Lovely themed gift. yeah friends themed and cheap Easy go to, to Revolution wrap. yeah for Revolution sure. if you sort it really <laughs> We did have a bit of issue we earlier did. on in the week and we still haven't resolved that one no. with them, but, but as far as their that. prices go, they're pretty yeah, bang yeah. on. Yeah. So the next item is one very near and dear to me. We will take a look at it. It's a bit disjointed because I'm wearing it on my lips tonight. But um it's the Phoebe lip kit. As it you know is I'm just Phoebe. Stunning, isn't it? Mm, it's a beautiful nude brown shades. Coming out. Um, so we have the Phoebe lip liner. I'll give a little swatch. I love having products with my name on it. <laughs> <laughs> so the lip liner is like so. It's a beautiful sort of nudie brown. Gorgeous for outlining the lip. And I've appeared with this one tonight. Now they're all just called Phoebe. They don't have names or shades. So it's Phoebe it is. Phoebe's the name of the day. And so I have this over it, this beautiful sort of the lighter of the two shades that we have in the Phoebe lip kit. They also have a Monica and Rachel lip kit if you're interested or if your name is either of those two. It's nice to have products with your name on. It or is. if you're just a fan of the character. 
I think it's a generational thing, isn't it? Yeah, it's a, it's actually the size of the back. Um, not even mention it. Lip kit containing two pigmented glosses and a creamy lip liner to recreate your favorite friend's character's nineties nude lip. So we all know that back in the nineties, everyone wanted to be Rachel or. That's the darker of the nudes. I'm not wearing that one now tonight. But it is, it would match lovely with the liner yeah, Rachel too. Rachel would have been a very popular name back Everyone the wanted the Rachel haircut, didn't they? <laughs> oh, that's right. It was like the Farrah from the 70s, mm. yeah, Rachel. Rachel was the 90s version of Farrah Fawcett. From Charlie's <laughs> Angels. I don't or know who the 80s was. <laughs> my preferred angel was Sabrina Duncan, Kate Jackson. I liked her the best. Yeah. I don't <laughs> know. But I think I liked um, Kelly. Right. <laughs> we'll just go with Kelly. <laughs> I think she'd have been my favourite or Farah. Right, <laughs> we'll leave that at that. Uh, next we have, I just picked these up though because they were really cheap and I thought they were so cute and I was surprised that they actually came in a little hold all bag, reusable bag. So cute for the face and so they're really good face masks and you just they also have a clasp on them, clasp design, so you can um, kind of alter to your ear shape and have them, you know, like tight or a little bit not tight. And they're, lo they're a lovely shape, well not a lovely shape, but a shape that we need I'd say. And I would imagine they are, as for safety reasons, they are pretty, pretty good. safe, yes. I'd say so, you can wear these yes. in. Yes, there is good... Um, Coverage, yeah. Quality to the yeah. material. So, so I'd imagine the they're black. pretty safe. And there's the lobster pink. Yeah. They're not flimsy. They're beautiful. Masks, as far as masks go, if you want to change their. Mm -hmm. I haven't actually opened this yet, but it's the Phoebe Friends X Revolution setting spray. There's hyaluronic acid, which I know you love, mm -hmm. and vitamin C. I was actually wondering why it was yellow when I got it in my haul or in my uh it's a yellow sort of a spray and i was wondering why that was when i got it in the post and um you informed me that it's because vitamin c is in it mm -hmm. um so that's okay i was told maybe it was a little bit no out of date or something but no this is vitamin c and there's two little um little silver balls at the bottom i don't know if you can see but um it's one of those products you can't really keep fresh isn't it yeah you i haven't used it yet it's even in sealed. cosmetics as far as i know it's quite difficult to keep it so we'll open it now and give it a little smell i guess yeah do give it a shake and a, a little spritz. bit of a shake and a spritz mm -hmm. why not have a little bit of a shimmy shimmy <laughs> <laughs> absolutely and in case anybody is wondering the palette i am wearing tonight I'm going out of my comfort zone and I went th with the pivot. Was the pivot? Pivot, it was the blue. The, the blue gold. I was drawn to, and I usually am quite afraid of blues. Where are these for? I went with blue tonight. <laughs> it's beautiful. And I'm really happy with the look I achieved. It's a really nice palette mm. and really nice it's in your It's a beautiful dark palette. Eyes. Yeah, it's nice and dark, guys. Yeah. The blue. It's the opposite on the colour way, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so it's supposed to emphasise the shade of dark, guys. As opposed to brown. Or blue on blue. It blue on really blue, work. yeah. No. So this is the spray. I'm kind of scared to spray myself on camera. I don't know. <laughs> spray, spray. <laughs> I'll have a little... Oops. It's a spritz. Oh my goodness. It smells nice? It smells like Californian orange juice. Smell. Oh, it does. Oh, it smells gorgeous. Um, it smells beautiful. like fresh orange, squeezed Very, oranges. Very um, fizzy, like yes. fizzy orange or something. Do you want to? Will I spray it on my face? Yes, yeah, from a distance. Okay, here we go. I'm scared. Do you want me to do it? Yeah. <laughs> okay, close your eyes. Okay. Yeah? <laughs> All over my hair. No, don't open it in that. Settle. <laughs> We're not going to delete this because in years to come, this will be <laughs> memorable. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my new hair. Oh. We we'll get to that later. Yeah, we will. We will. If you don't, so we've gone for a bit of a change today. <laughs> or, yeah. <laughs> so next item is one I picked up and it was only like €2.30. 
but it's a fabulous um sheer brilliant revolution makeup revolution lip gloss i'm not sure if it's matte but we'll try it out on the hand give it a swatch next to these it's a beautiful mauve it's actually called magenta on the website oh it's lovely it's it was glossy like, is it yeah it seems to be glossy yeah now that i see and a swatch mm -hmm. uh and that's that. That was a bargain. It's in the shade Poise, sheer Poise, and it has the okay. R on the top for Revolution, of course. Sheer Brilliant Revolution, London. Not bad for in the sale. And the last item before we get into our surprise <laughs> at the end of the video, which we're not going to tell you about, is this Bratz hair dye. And, and it's it's brilliant before pretty you go ahead. Pretty Princess Rose, it's the Yasmin shade. We know if you're familiar with Yasmin from the Bratz. And as you can see, she's blonde at the top and kind of dip dyed pink at the bottom. It's a beautiful pinky, purpley shade. And as you can see, well, I don't know if you can, but on camera, but I, I have my hair dyed in it. And I really like it. It's sort of a pinky. It came out on me not quite as pink as you see in the bottle. I got the bottle for review purposes. So that would be kind of what it went like going on. What it looked like going on. But my hair is so thick and... At the very end you can really see it. Yeah, you can. But you would have needed two or three of them because your hair is so long and so thick. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what but I was there, about it took to... really well. It did. There's one little bit that's sort of purpley, silvery. You can really see the colour there. Pinky blonde. Yeah, if we had more of it, it would have taken much better. It's fabulous. I was sort of going for the Lisa Vanderpump look. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you're familiar, the Real Housewives. And I like it. It's, it's lovely. I just needed one or two, or two or three more bottles. <laughs> for it's my very good. Thickness. And I applied it for Phoebe. Yeah. With a pair of rubber gloves and it didn't smell. No, it was no, sick. and you only had to rinse it out and clean hair yeah. with water. Water, so I washed my no hair prior, really and then we applied it. when it was dry, and then I rinsed it out. I, I left it on for a little longer than thirty minutes, they say, because it's so thick and it's so like, you know, it was absorbing it really quickly. Mm -hmm. But um, that's just the type of hair I have. But I'd say if you had the quantity you need it, it would have turned yeah. out more, more, much more vibrant it would have been lovely it i might have. actually get a few more bottles of that it's only four euro uh 50 or something like that and it's gorgeous it's really nice for mm -hmm. for the sake of the money like and it conditions the hair also. it does my hair is so soft at the ends and it was kind of not bad condition but it was a little bit dry before and over the other side where it took yeah, there's lovely wrinklets. It's much better than the I side. I will say so love. myself. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. I will say so myself. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> right, so next. If you stay tuned, is that the last? That's the last of that, yeah. Right, so if you want to see part two, the surprise part of our revolution yep. haul. Can't wait for the surprise. Stay tuned. So this is part two or the second half of the video and this was the surprise item awesome, yeah. so i'm going to let phoebe go through it with you and she will give you all the details and information needed go ahead here we go so this is the surprise of the video the end of the surprise it's the friends x revolution merry christmas 12 days of christmas advent calendar <laughs> i know you're not confused is this baby yeah <laughs> you might be a little bit confused by that in the middle of February, Merry Christmas calendar, but um, I thought I'd give it a go when I saw it in the sale. Yeah, and get with lots of surprises. And it well, was it was a good it, price point. It was. It was only twenty two euro fifty in the sale, and it was originally we leave the price um in the video somewhere. <laughs> I don't know, but okay. uh, it was I think fifty euro or seventy euro for the price of Christmas. So it was well reduced. It was. Mm -hmm. So I kind of had a little bit of a peek at the website, and I, it shows you on the website what's um in the box prior to purchasing. So I have a feeling I know what's in it. Mm -hmm. I know the products, but we haven't unboxed them yet. Okay. So here we go. Let's Give, go. We'll open her up. I've been dying to see what's in it all day and Phoebe wouldn't let me cheat. No, <laughs> I said we have to wait for the video. 
Yeah. <laughs> you have to be good. <laughs> so that's the it's gorgeous. It has this sort of um ivy and leaves and candy canes. It's Christmassy, obviously. <laughs> See this is an advent calendar. So we got one first, will we? Yes. That's seven or is that one? Where's the one? Oh here's one. So it's so cute, it's like a little box. Where, yeah. yeah, so they're quite small, the compartments. You take her out in the box there. Can't wait to see what she is, number one. It's light. I'm feeling I know what this is, because I saw her on the webs. Oh, her, why am I saying her? <laughs> I saw it. So I'm biased. <laughs> yes. <laughs> she has to be a girl. <laughs> she has to be. Uh, it's, yeah, I thought that this was what it was. It's the Friends Revolution sponge. Yeah. And we have a friend's extra revolution and a little thingy embedded on it. Yeah, that's so quite nice. That is a gorgeous sponge. It's a, it's sort of a teal mint color. It's almost too nice to use. Almost. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. I'm not really a big sponge person. I have sponges similar to this in my Alice in Wonderland, which we showed before. Before. We do, yeah, we have um, Spectrum Alison. ones as well. We do, we? we have a pink one, we have pink ones. Or, um, oh, there's a drawing, is there? Yeah, there is, there's some sort of a holiday car cartoon, caricature. <laughs> right, that's number one. Number that's two. That's one. Oh, this is exciting, isn't it? I love unboxing things. Two, yeah. here we go, two. <gasps> My favourites. This is what I was looking forward to. The scrunchies. Oh, you can't go wrong with scrunchies. They're scrunchies fabulous. Have been out since the 80s. No, I know Revolution had a scrunchie set, but they're sold. They were sold. They sold out really quick. So we have the Central Park pink one, the coffees, Monica's door, and the ducks. That's fabulous, isn't it? Aren't they so silky and soft? Oh, they're lovely, aren't they? They are absolutely fabulous. That's almost the colour we were hoping your hair would yeah, come out. It is. Isn't it? Yeah. So it would kind of blend into my hair if, if it was pink. I, they are gorgeous. They, they soft. really are nice. They are, if the original friend scrunchies they brought out were anything like that, then I should have bought them. And even these, you could split them up and give them as little gifts. Yeah, yeah. in the boxes. Because um, scrunchies, if you don't know, are actually... Or not scrunchies. Silk is actually very good for your hair. It... um. And it reduces fine lines if you use a silk pillow case. Oh, yeah. So I'd imagine it yeah. was static, yeah. It would kind of, using those scrunchies, would sort of get rid of static electricity in your hair, which I have a lot of. <laughs> the curliness of my hair. So we go on to number three. It's a little bit heavy. Let's see what one this is. Like I said, oh, it's a lipstick that I saw. It comes a bit shaky, shaky. It has a little bit of paper in it to, so yeah, to keep it protected, I guess. So we'll leave that over there. That's a tree, and it's the friend's lipstick that comes in the box. The advent calendar. Oh, beautiful! It has well, the I love lips. their packaging for their lipstick. Yeah. It has the lip embedded on it, like um. And I love these. Yeah, the lip at the top, lips emblem. Um, that is, is there a shade on it? It, there isn't. I know it looks just like the Phoebe Monica Rachel lipstick with so the lips. The I will do a little swatch. I would put it on my lips, but I don't remember. <laughs> so that's a no. Wow. That yeah. is so pigmented, isn't it? That is really It goes on nice. like butter. Mm -hmm. Like butter. <laughs> yeah, for sure. What's that? Oh, it's just a lip. <laughs> so that is good. That's a yes. And so are the scrunchies a yes. Definitely, definitely worth it for those anyway. That's three, number four. Four, I'm confused. I was like going to ask you what number we're doing next. <laughs> four. Here we go. Let's see. I think I know what this might be. I don't know. It's paper. <laughs> Maybe it's not what I thought. No, it's not what I thought it was. It's actually the lip gloss. Oh. Lovely. Has that one got a shade on it? Um, those are my glasses. But I don't think so. It's red. it's a very vibrant red, as you can see. Oh, I like Candy that. Candy canes. It's Christmas effect. And it's Christmas. an orange red, isn't it? It is. It's very red. Not a blue toned red. 
No, we'll give it a swatch, but I might give this to you if you like it. Because I'm not really a red girl. Yeah. More of a mauve or a nude girl. That's beautiful. Pink, even. Do you like it? Snow White esque. Yes. Friends, there you can have that one. Lovely. I won't, <laughs> I won't be. No. I won't be too greedy with the advent calendar. <laughs> Here we go. Thank you. So we're on five next. Is that right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, well, five is actually a long kind of box. It's heavy. I think I know what this one is too. I'm very thinking I know about everything, aren't I? Mm -hmm. So we, I, yeah, it's what I thought it was because it was heavy. A setting spray. So if you've seen in earlier on in the video, I had a setting spray, a Phoebe one. This one isn't yellow like that. It's a, oh god, I have a malfunction. Um, it's kind of a, it's a white obviously. It's, it's it. pale. Stop. Okay, so we nearly had a malfunction there. <laughs> um, <laughs> so I had to cut. But this is obviously the a setting spray. It's a clear colour, ready to party check. So we'll give it we'll, we won't give it a spritz actually because I already have one. Do you want to spray it into the cap just to yeah, see if there is a scent. Uh, scent on it? Not really, I'd say. No. Not really. No, for people like clear. me who don't like scents on their Set and so I'm going to give that one to someone because I have my baby one, yep. the hyaluronic acid. Yep, that one's fine. Yep. So is it six next? I'm not keeping track really. Heavy. Six. Six. There we go. Now this is either a lip balm or a lip scrub, I'm sure. Oh, beautiful colour. It's the balm, yeah. The Balm Jovi lip balm. Is that what it's called? No. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> or I was no. thinking the balm had uh, the balm. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's clear actually. It looks pink in the pot. But it actually goes on sort of rosy clear. Just kind of a hint. A tint, yeah. Hint a little of tint. A tint, yeah. hint of a tint. We got a little bit of a hint of a tint. So we put that back. That's um really cute i've dug my finger into it so maybe you don't want that <laughs> thank you i don't know so seven i think this is the scrub it's kind of heavy so i'm guessing by the shape of it and the everything that's the scrub yeah i'd say so so this is a lip scrub which i love i use the project lip ones at the moment but i'll definitely give that a go well I've... they're very practical aren't they the yeah the items in it they are for everyday use. Yeah. Because a lot of calendars hard. you get items that aren't. Yeah, there's little grains of. The grains are to. Sugar or sugar. Yeah. The grains are to. Yeah, um, there's a nice scent of it. It's light. Mm. So that's seven. Coming to February, people's lips will need. I see. I can see. And I can see that the last few objects or no <laughs> items we won't put that out. <laughs> items, should I say, are the larger items. So we see eight, eleven, ten, and twelve here are kind of big. Nine is a bit big too. What are we doing? We're at eight next, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So eight. eight is a very big box, but it's very light in weight. Mm. This is one of my favourites. It's tiny, but it's so cute. I'm guessing this is for the little brushes that spoiler alert the brushes come do we get we get a few brushes on this so I'll just say that much it said that on the um, it did it showed the picture of what's in it but I had no idea that the makeup bag would be this small but it's so cute and I'll keep it because it's just so cute so it has a scent it's sort of strong <laughs> it smells like to me the um the little light Boys, the hoops that you learn how to swim in yeah. the pool, the little, the chlorine. that you blow up, the little, inflatable, yeah, inflatables. the inflatable little yeah. rings, like the donut shape rings from the pool, yeah, definitely, smell again, yeah, I get there, what you mean, there is I a do powerful get what you mean. scent off it, so, but it's so cute that you that can't deny it, it is cute, it is cute, you could even use it for coins, yeah, or it'd be ideal for like a child maybe, to put some, Grounds in or something like that. Yeah, going away. Yeah, on. 
So that was in oh. your bag for heading off. Was that nine or is this nine? That was eight. Eight, eight. nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So, like I thought, I think, yeah, the brushes are in this one. They're tiny, aren't they? But they're so cute. And they're pink. With little um, lobsters on. Come on. They can come in very handy, a tiny size brush. Yeah. Brushes, yeah. I love contour and small brushes. And even a little bit of highlight. So, we've one sort of angled eyeshadow brush. With a bigger, I don't know if, if it's an eyeshadow brush or a sort of a yeah, it's a flat brush, isn't it? Sort of a yeah. highlight, give me a little bit of a highlight. <laughs> <laughs> what am I like anyway? Um, so there, and this is the bigger of the two, which is sort of a powdery brush, powder brush, I guess. So, why am I always smelling products? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, there's no, yeah, no, there's not. They're really cute, aren't they? They're so cute, and mm -hmm. they'd be perfect for the little bag. Absolutely. The bag. A little cute gift for someone, or for yourself, or wherever you like. So we'll do 10 next, obviously. Numerology. <laughs> I don't know what that word is. Go ahead. Numerical order, there we go. Numerical order. Oh, right. palettes. Yeah, there's Lovely. two palettes. Oh, well, there's two palettes in it. I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have said that. I sort of spoiled you, didn't I? palettes in it. Yeah. I don't want to spoil you, but <laughs> there's, there's two palettes. There's two more palettes apart from the vols. They do. And they have a three tanks given palettes, too. We take this off the computer yeah. to see. So what shades are these, then? They're if you gorgeous, turn it backwards, you yeah. see the um, Okay, the so we won't flash it with the mirror. Um, these are very um Christmassy themed we have gingerbread tree decorations mold wine winter wonderland 25th star and lights and they're just gorgeous that one is so pretty isn't I it i love mold wine is that what that one is <laughs> no it's lights lights it's lovely beautiful and a sort of um and slightly this one too this one is like light is slightly unusual isn't it a shimmery red orange Absolutely, ready orange yeah, yeah. That's an unusual colour, I will say. actually. And of course... It's not a coral. It's deeper than a coral. But it's not red. Yeah. I'm going to have to take a little swatch of that. Super. So, um, Barbie over here, of course, loves decorations <laughs> and winter. <laughs> because pink and purple and wonderland a little bit too. And gingerbread. Purple. Yeah. I love my pinks, as you can tell. And we'll do the pink. Yeah. For you. Specifically, oh, that's gorgeous! So Barbie, <laughs> oh, they're lovely. Yeah, lovely. They're really pretty colors. It's really nice to get a palette, Sorry a palette in the calendar, more. isn't it? You, usually, you don't. Yeah, like palettes are. I love palettes, obviously. Palettes, yeah, they always let you. Cunning. But um, <laughs> yeah, obviously we love palettes over here. Thank you for the shout out. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay you later. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be waiting. <laughs> So this is the second palette I was talking about, and 12 I won't tell you what that is because I've spoiled you already enough. You're getting spoilt. Spoilt. Uh, this is, oh, they're gorgeous. I'll just take this off. Yeah, and I'll kind of cover this up. And can we bend it back? Bend it back, yeah, back. I hate doing that sort of things. I hate um, photographers and they hate destroying products and destroying packaging. Do, don't you? I want to keep it so perfect. <laughs> but um, they're very muted colours and I love them. So we'll see. check out the names. I'll read them out to you here. Holidays, Gifts, Xmas, Happy, Santa, Festive, Reindeer, Candy Cane and Armadillo. Oh, lovely. Neutral palette. Yeah, it is. It reminds so, me of the Obsessions. You did your collab. Oh, it does, yeah. It's not quite as warm, though. No. But I think I prefer that one, actually. Do you? It's less red, yeah. It's less deep. It's so cute. Mm -hmm. And oh, we forgot the palettes have on the front when your favorite tune comes on, Shadow Palette. That's the first one. And the Did Somebody Say Party palette? So that's that. That's really nice. I love the mini idea palettes. Of the palette They're sort of miniature. Yeah, I've been in a calendar. Oh, I'm so sad. We're at 12 already. Oh, well, he's gotten so much in the yeah. calendar, he can't complain. Greedy girl. But anyway, we're at 12, so I won't tell you what it is. I'll unbox it and 
ones. We'll see what it is. Mm -hmm. So are you ready? Go ahead. See what she is. She's a bunch of paper. No, I'm only joking. She's an aunt. <laughs> um, so here we go. We'll open her up. Go ahead. I can't wait to see it. Oh, it's a little miniature. It's a of the one you have. have. Yeah, of the big friends, Mur. Oh, that is so nice, isn't it? A miniature of her. And why am I saying that today? I don't Keep know. Keep it that way with the Murray. Sorry, yeah. So I'm just disappointed revolution for sure now a, with that advent calendar, I have no, to say. No, they didn't. I have to say it was worth the money. And even and full price I don't know, but full price I don't know either. But definitely in the sale, absolutely a bargain. Yeah. Yeah. Well so that's the Friends X Revolution miniature dormer. I'm sure a lot of people would have bought it at full price just just for just for, in case they were living gone. The gift, yeah. But well, thankfully they still have some and so if you're in, if you liked what you saw where did you purchase it? Make a revolution website. Off the revolution brand. Yes. Website. I don't think you can get it on any other stockists website. Um I think it's um limited edition and also um exclusive. Oh. To their website. I think now I could be wrong, could so have been a good at Christmas. This Who knows? over here beside you, so yeah, everyone gets a reminder of what was so in it. So when we rank our favorite products and our favorite not product, <laughs> yep, go right. ahead. You you do number it. one for me because you're the friends fan. We leave it Numero to you. Numero uno, Phoebe goes with scrunchies. I love scrunchies, and you know you can always tie your hair back. They're so handy, and these ones are like silk. I'm not even joking. I love the Central Park one. Love the Mer one. Door um. And the ducks, they're just gorgeous, okay, fabulous. Your number one product, um, number two. Oh, hard. Oh, um, I'm going with the brushes because brushes are. I love brushes, and the, you can never have too many. Well, you probably can, but <laughs> we go with only when washing comes around. Yeah, <laughs> we go with these gorgeous brushes, fabulous. Number two. Will we combine them with the makeup purse? We will. We will. Even though she is a we rubbery those. purse, we can... no. Okay, so we go number three. Yeah. So I'm going with the. We we'll do a top five. Top five. Okay. Yeah. And the the purse and the brushes are as one. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going with the lipstick. It's so buttery. And it's a stunning color. So the swatcher again. I do not know why I'm saying that word a lot today. I have to do a bloopers reel. There's enough colour in it, but yeah, yeah it's not. It's beautiful. Um, it's just t right up my street, yeah. It's the type of shade I like. Four? Four for me. I'm going to go with the mirror. Because mirrors, you just always need a mirror, don't you? Always. You can't do your makeup without one. So and trust that one is your really It's compact. Nice. It's like a little palette. Mm -hmm. And since you have the big one already. So yeah, it's, like it's cute to have the two. Yeah. So, five. number five, um, I'm going to go with the. Sorry now for the products I left out, but I'm going to go with the When Your Favourite Tune Comes On palette. Yeah, I'd have went with that one too. Yeah. It's, I it's my favourite. Sorry, I flashed. Uh, it's my favourite of the two palettes, actually. Absolutely. It's definitely the more. That mulled wine colour is fabulous, isn't it? The yellow. Yeah, they are beautiful. I don't know why I like yellow. <laughs> um, so, top five out of the calendar. Set. My top five, yeah. Your top five. So, then. sorry to the lip gloss, the the um spritzy spray that did somebody say party palette, the lip scrub and the lip balm and the sponge. Sorry. Okay. Will they will definitely come in handy. They will. The, in. No, let me just preface it by saying that everything in the box is useful. Mm -hmm. but yeah, there was no duds. No, there's nothing I'd say, oh, I don't want that. Yeah, usually <laughs> there is in these gift boxes. There's always a couple of things you really Duds, wouldn't. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Duds. Advent calendars in general, that's yeah. a disappointment. But no, that's a thumbs up from me. Definitely. Two thumbs up from me for Revolution and their advent calendar. And all their new products that we've tested here we'll today done. and went through. So we hope that you enjoyed our video. 
and if you did i let phoebe ask you for a thumbs up please give us a thumbs up <laughs> <laughs> and um in true friends fashion um i'll always be here for you oh thank you <laughs> we'll just say that because it's a friends video <laughs> Sorry. Thank you, Phoebe. Cringy. <laughs> I won't sing because I'm not a great singer. <laughs> oh, that's a good end of the video. <laughs> okay. So give us a big thumbs up and leave a comment what your favourite product was, if you've tried the calendar. Say hi you, to Phoebe. Say if hi to wish. me. Um, and if you like the calendar and um, basically if you would purchase it. And funnily enough, Phoebe, um, for anyone that doesn't know, who isn't um, friends with me on Instagram? Phoebe's second name is Faye. It is. Not Boo Faye. Not Boo Faye. Faye. That's, uh, I won't say, but um, my Instagram handle is something similar to that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so it's Phoebe Faye, not Phoebe but Faye. No. And friends was a couple of months coming after you were born. So. Yeah, everyone always thinks I was named after Phoebe but Faye, but I wasn't. No. <laughs> she, her first name was Pig by her dad and her second name was picked by me but i understand people thinking that because it came from the 90s and friends is from the 90s and you know after um the old movie star alice Faye and fay ray from king kong oh. i picked the face so and you've told me that before I didn't yeah know. i'm surprised and i think the phoebe could have came from phoebe gates phoebe gates yeah um, there's a phoebe gates too isn't there she was in um lace the mini series and um, Drop Dead Fred. Yeah, I know that Phoebe really Kate, she's beautiful. Yeah. I think that's where the Phoebe came from. Um, <laughs> Not friends. No. But having said that, we don't. And there's also Phoebe from Charmed and Phoebe from. There's lots of Phoebe. Yeah, there's lots of Phoebe's now. There wasn't that. No, then. it was very unique when it was born. I'm sure. Yeah, it was. Back in 92. Yeah, it was. November of 92. Yeah, I think Phoebe means shiny. Fairy. And fairy means fairy, so you're the shining fairy. I didn't know that. I am the shining fairy. <laughs> <laughs> so, Silly. there's a little bit of extra information and trivia. personal details. Trivia, yeah. For Phoebe everyone fans. watching. <laughs> <laughs> so, we leave it at that. And thank you for spending time with us. We've appreciated it. And we've had fun going through everything with you so. and always remember that i'll be here for you okay i'll be there for you when the rain starts to fall <laughs> <laughs> bye bye